So today is April 25th and we are finally starting to get some warm temperatures. The temperature today was probably about 60 degrees or so. And that is the perfect temperature for a cool season lawn between, you know, 55 and 70 ish. And so the grass is growing really well right now. And so I've got the urge to mow. Today is Wednesday. I did a double cut on the lawn on Monday and I just am feeling it and I want to go for it. I find that the more you mow it, the easier it is to maintain at that short height. I like to maintain my lawn at around 5 eighths of an inch. I may go down to a half inch this year, possibly, but right now I'm at 5 eighths of an inch. I've got my Toro Greensmaster 1600 down there and I'm gonna go for it. So today is a beautiful day, slight breeze, a perfect day to get some mowing done. So before I mow, I wanna talk about this product right here. This is from Fertilome and it's called Over the Top 2 and this is really good for killing grassy weeds in your beds or in your bushes in places where you don't want grass but you want say your ground covers or your tall perennials or your short perennials or some bushes and places like that this is really good for that i'm going to spray this in my raspberry patch where i've got a bunch of weeds and things you'll want to use a surfactant with this or it won't really be as effective or not effective at all i'm going to show you how this works a little bit later i picked this up today and i'm really stoked to have this so I'm gonna make a couple quick trim passes all the way around, then I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna just do a straight pattern right here. I think I'm just gonna do single stripes and see what that looks like. I have not done that yet with the Toro Greensmaster 1600. So that's it for this side. I think it's about time to start with the growth regulator because I mowed this two nights ago and I have emptied this four times. Granted, this is 7,500 square feet, so it's a lot of grass to mow, but it's growing quite quickly. The temperatures are just about perfect for cool season grass. I'm mowing this at about 5 8 inch and it's handling it just fine. So my perennials are starting to come up. I've got the daffodils coming up that I planted last fall. And some of my perennials that I had from last year are starting to come up and show their face. It's a pretty exciting thing to see spring come up and spring up. I've got some good things planned for in here. I want lots of color and it'll make the lawn really pop. And so I'm kind of really excited about this. And I'm excited to show you how this kind of progresses over the course of the summer. I totally recommend going the real mower route if you've got the time and energy to pull it off. And it's soft, lush, and thick. There's little to no weeds at all in this lawn here. Today is April 25th and I just got done mowing the lawn and we are in prime cool season grass growing conditions. The temperature is around 60 degrees or so and it is looking fantastic. Appreciate you guys watching these videos and I will see you in the next video.